What is going on, you guys? It is your boy MT here. Here. This is ITZX. You kind of got some eye. Was, yeah, my eye was twitching. <laughs> I don't know why. Like sometimes my eye just does that. Like, my eyelid just like twitches. And I don't know. Anyways, episode nineteen to modernity. Um, I think I pronounced it. Right. God, I'm not even gonna go into it. Never mind. Uh, now that the invasion is kind of continuing, obviously from the last episode, getting introduced to. Uh, yeah, the H is silent, right? Just yoga. I think that's what it is. Just, I think yoga. Is spear his, fucker. Which, his spear is cool. Um, and his spear is fucked. That is true, yeah. His spear did get fucked by Gen. So, I'm interested to see how they're going to go about it this time. Uh, obviously, they made Katana's last episode, which was really, really cool. But, obviously, the invasion is continuing. We're going to keep getting introduced to Sukasa's army and what other characters are on his army. I'm still interested to see, because so far, he is one of my top, uh, top maybe five. I will maybe get my ranks in the season finale, but definitely Yoga, from his design and his overall, like, fight it, like fighting skill, he's definitely up there for now, depending on who they introduce. But so far, we are going to go right into the episode. If you guys are new to the channel, you guys like our reaction, make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment down below, and if you guys want to get notified on when we release videos, definitely smash the notification bell. If you guys want to check out our merch and Discord. Links in the description. With well, that being said, let's go ahead and episode 19. So what I heard is, Sukas has been looking for him the whole time. Yeah? Seriously? So who is this guy? Is this him? Yes, this is Awakening. Mm. Welcome, Yoga. You're now 3,700 years into the future. <laughs> I was thinking he was gonna bring back a real badass fighter, but this guy looks like a little toothpick. Yeah, how's a shrippy dude gonna help us anyway? <laughs> Fight him and you'll understand. I feel kind of bad for the little guy. He may still be sleepy after his long nap. <laughs> I don't mind. Oh, yeah? Well, it's too late for you to back out now! Okay. Hmm. Ah. <laughs> the only proper fighter here, by which I mean I the only one I wouldn't want to fight, is you. You're the strongest primate high schooler. Shishio Sukasa, after all. Oh my god. I'm glad you've joined us. Oh. Let me show you around our new world. Damn, she is swole as fuck. I know, right? My god. She, she's fucking big thickens. Oh, I like that. I like that as design. You see, suppose those in the privileged class of the old world were revived Jerry. today. And they obtained the weapons of science that make killing so easy. What would happen? I imagine they'd try to use it's those principles to recreate. No way! No, way! no fucking I'm way! Like, I know I've heard this no fucking drink of that sweet nectar. Fucking heard could be compelled to abandon it. Regardless, this world has been reset. It's in no condition to support <laughs> seven billion lives. Oh, I'm like, I'm, I'm like, shit. hold on! I know this motherfucker. The two dude. deadliest warriors alive today, and they're in total <sighs> agreement with each other. I had to kill him with my own hands. With no Senku, there will be no science. We have to remove his head from his body. Yeah, that's because yeah, the first time didn't work. Yeah, Nezuko or Nezu, Principal Nezu. <laughs> Remarkable athleticism combined with coordinated teamwork and a dirty betrayal. <laughs> Add to that the scientific knowledge to create guns and Japanese katanas. You people seem to know the proper way to do things. What would have been more proper? was if you would realize that all of this was merely a distraction. <laughs> oh my god! Son of a bitch. No way. It burned down. Who is that? Interesting. A hindrance. Get everyone to safety! That's who she is. Inca looking mother. Gonna have 
a challenge for Kohaku. Our moves are incredible. There's no guarantee they'll attack head on. Keep your eyes and ears open for anything. Can we really protect this many people? He still but doesn't have a weapon. Oh my ship. god. They'll be safer. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh hey, Hamura. The kingdom of science. I gotta protect it somehow. Uh, look! There's some dumb kid who didn't get away in time! <laughs> Lead him. Oh yeah, we found ourselves a hostage, boys! <laughs> That's an option. What? Suika ran away! I, uh, tried to stop her, but she took off toward the hot springs! Wait a sec. I come here all the time to get water from these hot springs. It gets dangerous up ahead. The poison gases that form here... Oh, that's gonna be dangerous! Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Jesus, that squirrel maybe had a family. Oh, shit. You don't need to worry. The poison gas will settle below us. Hey, you pimp squeak! You were the one who made all this poison gas, huh? Uh, <laughs> yeah, damn right it was me. <laughs> that was a pretty dumbass move launching an attack on the kingdom of science. We'll need to make sure the gas is gone before we move. This is a great opportunity. You lot can finally perform a job as you should, despite your mushy brains. Ooh. <laughs> oh, wow. Shit. Well, look at that. They actually died. Oh, I already started building a new bridge. And new houses, too. Okay. The revival fluid that Sukas us guys have been cranking out is actually pretty easy to make. And yet, we still haven't revived a single statue. That's True. because we don't have enough nitric acid. Uh, well, so what are we gonna do? Uh, I think it's fairly obvious. We'll just have to attack them first with a ridiculously awesome scientific toy. <laughs> Interesting. We've got leaps and bounds, but now it's time for us to break out the ultimate modern tech. We've been recreating scientific advancements from as far back as the Stone Age, but we're finally getting to something from my time. What was truly the deciding factor in modern conflicts? Wait, you don't mean nukes, do you? Hell no. There's something else that can give one side a huge advantage. I'm talking about communications technology. We're gonna make cellular. Oh my god, <laughs> I had a feeling. Stone world. Oh Shall shit. You learn? Uh, uh, has he lost his mind? <laughs> he just said something really crazy. So you can have a conversation with someone. Even if they're super far away? Definitely sounds like sorcery to me. How could an idea that crazy even possibly exist? <laughs> so bad. I gotta know how that works. Team excited. <laughs> and that's gonna gotta be know how it works. Uh, you <laughs> bet it will. Look, suppose we have a double agent who leaks intel to us in real time. It's Gan reporting. Senku, the enemy is completely wide open on the west side. There are barely any guards to speak of. Over. Oh, it's fucking Gan hell. <laughs> But who would we use to be our double agent? Who do you think? Uh, we've already got our mole over there. <laughs> Two of them, in fact. Yes, sir. I had a feeling, yes, sir. Smartphones! Oh, sure. Yeah. <laughs> Smartphones would be great, wouldn't they? Smartphones? You do love your smartphones. And they're finally introducing that him back. Big Elf was desperate to get his hands on a smartphone from the very beginning. Now, he's finally gonna get his wish. Granted, this will be more like a regular phone, not necessarily the smart kind. Oh, ah! We can do this! 
That sulfur drug was a hell of a lot of work, <laughs> but we made that happen, didn't we? No offense, guys, but I don't think you realize what he's saying. This roadmap's full of things that are impossible to get. <laughs> Nothing is impossible, Gen. No matter how far off the goal may seem, holy if shit! You follow the steps, you'll get there ten billion percent of the time. That's how science works. Oh man, that's a lot. That's at least double what they had to do for the yeah. Oh god. Every single one of Gen's reports was a lie. The village already has considerable scientific power. And what's more, Senku is alive. He's pissed! <laughs> and concerned. Yeah! Oh, damn! Hold on, damn! If you guys missed the theory that I said a couple reactions ago about somehow, some way, Taiju and Yuziriha being dead, I, I wonder if my prediction is going to come become real. So obviously you're not going to tell me and I don't want to know anything about, but just like I'm thinking about it because I wasn't expecting him to bring uh, bring them up because at first I thought they were meaning Gen, but at first, well, I mean, uh, secondly, Gen already blew his cover. So I'm like, okay, who who else would it be? Yuziria and fucking Taiju. So I'm wondering if that is the sad moment, but honestly, I, I don't know what to expect. But overall, this episode was pretty good. I like the introduction to, I believe her name was, her, no, I was about to say Hamea, but it begins with an H. I'll, I'll probably know at the next episode, but she, she was definitely on some sort of gymnastics team or cheerleading or something, because she is very athletic, like very athletic. She couldn't even keep up, or like Kohaku couldn't even keep up with her. So, intro to C, next couple episodes. Hopefully it's not too sad because the uh, the episode a couple of weeks or the couple uh, episodes ago was really really sad kind of so I don't know what else could top it but who knows we're still going through the kind of war right now but a couple more episodes to go thank you guys for watching our reaction you guys are excited for the rest of the Doctor Stone series and you guys like our channel like subscribe comment down below and if you guys want to get notified on when we release videos definitely smash the notification bell and as always I'm OC that is Schmidty and we are out.